is up you guys it's your boy electro flame jd in the house back again once again for a beautiful wonderful self center revenge and today people today we are here for e1 and m6 command center on doom double impact this will be done by 100% kills items and secrets i hope you guys enjoy and let's get on with the show hi there how you all doing today i'm doing marvelous so it is Sunday today and I'm hoping you guys are enjoying your Sunday morning, afternoon and evening because as for me, I'm going to enjoy this with death. Now this is a very big map with 10 secrets. So let's get on to it, shall we? And the first thing we're going to do is run to this corner and get some shells as we go along and making sure we don't get hurt. That bad. Yeah, we're gonna get hurt extremely bad. Uh, we do have a specter, which I did not wake up. So let's wake him up. Ooh, chips for breakfast. I love chips for breakfast. Anyway, let's go quickly down here for that specter. Now, quote unquote, there's gonna be like one or two rooms that we're not going to enter. But that's because we're gonna get the jump on most of the enemies. So, to your left and right, just you know, do that. Make them go splat splat. Come on. There we go. Nicely, nicely done. And your first room that you're not going to be entering is this blue room over here. This alcove you might enter because it's holding a special key that we need. Anyways, let's quickly deal with these enemies from here. Go away, you. And... Going around here. Yes, going around here. Let's quickly lure those guys over here because I don't want to waste any shells. There we go. Nicely done. Pat on the shoulder. And uh, let's get him out. Because he's going to be a pain. He's going to be a pain in the butt. There we go. Going down here because I need a, I need a bigger weapon. So let's wake those two up. Let them come to us because we don't want to make a noise just yet. There we go. Ah. Lovely. They were a married couple. Okay, let's get the jump on these guys very quickly. And here we have the chain gun. Can you, uh, wow. Can you not do that again, please? Okay, over here we do have a loss to be sold. So let's wake the loss to be sold up. Ouch. Where are you? You're dead. And you're dead. Okay. We'll come to them just now. So let's grab our first secret. Which is, if you see this green tile over here compared to the two brown ones. Shut up, you. This one is a switch. A switch. To open this up. And this is your first secret. Some nice goodies over here, including a vulnerability. Very good idea to have this one, especially when you're having enemies like that. Okay, now you could choose between upstairs or downstairs, it doesn't really matter. What matters is the secret. So let's grab our chain gun for a bit. Chain gun. And uh, say hello to everybody else. So, most of the time, you are going to get hurt. Other times, you're not going to get hurt. Let's wait these guys up very quickly. Get rid of this imp over here. Yeah, chip damage from... Um, from... Uh, from zombie men is a very painful thing. Really, truly, a painful thing to have. Come on. Okay, you got me, fair and square. So, anyways, where this light is shining, 
towards this wall over here. Lower it for your second secret. And then we can grab a mega arm. Much needed mega arm. This is our second secret indeed. Now then, we are donezo with this room. Let's get out of the cage. And the next room, we have three secrets. So, first thing we're going to do is the following. Is to say hello to these guys. And if you can, yeah, you know, just, you know, do that. And, ouch. How dare you, son? There we go. There we go. Okay, I hear you. Don't worry. There was one room that I did not show where we're going to be exiting out. And that room is right here. Where we're back at the beginning area. Very neat. Very clever. So your first two secrets. Let's grab them quickly. <coughs> Facing the door, which quote unquote is a secret, and we'll talk about that just now. <clears throat> Facing the door, turn to your right, immediately make a turn, and just kill everybody over there. There we go, nicely done. Where this green uh, sludge on the wall is, open it up for a backpack and some bonuses. And we can take the left back out. <coughs> Facing the door again, we're going left, long way left, for your next secret, which is a plasma gun, some plasma cells, and a teleporter that will take us back. Now for this, I mentioned it was a secret, but I do not know how to get there, and you do not know how to get there, correct? There is a hidden switch behind this techno pole over here, very cleverly hidden right there. So this is your fifth secret. Open it up because we need to get the yellow key. And the best part of this secret is the fact that we get the jump on enemies like that. So instead of getting the 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 the, the red key, we can just grab the yellow key here, which is a secret. Anyways, let's quickly jump down and deal with all of these enemies over here. Okay, very good. Nicely done. And then grab your goodies plus a rocket launcher. A much needed rocket launcher. Die. Just die. I don't want to hear you, see you, nothing. Anyways, as you step up here, we're going to have a few more enemies. Including you. Shut up. You're annoying. Let's grab some goodies over here. And then... Open the door. As you open the door, we're gonna have two zombie men and a sh uh, shotgunner. Plus another imp. Rocket launcher. Because we want to say hello to Mr. Kako over there. Mr. Kako. There we are. Okay, chain gun in hand, grab the rockets, and start at the bottom of this. Don't worry about the rest, don't worry about getting hurt so much, just try not to die. Try not to die, please, I beg of you. Try not to die, I repeat, try not to die. Try not to die, because... That's why right. I want to get rid of all those moving enemies as quickly as possible. And I want to consume as much plasma as possible. So, getting rid of those two hit scanners over here. Flipping the switch. And taking the lift up. There we go. And also we have a hidden here, imp and the yellow key to escape, just jump out of the window, back to the starting area. We have the yellow key, but we're not going to use it just yet. Now, for the part of the blue area. We are not going to go through here, 
because we're going to take a different route for it. Interact with this door first and slowly but surely work your way around everything. Grab as much uh, things as you need, the goodies and things, and just kill the enemies as far as you can. Hello! Yes, and dark corners make it excellent for uh, specters to come around, especially over here. You're dead. And around this corner we have another enemy. Perfect. Now for your f your next secret. Interact with the switch, but take your chain gun out and kill Mr. Pinky over here, followed by not just one imp, but two imps. There we go. Grab the backpack and grab the bullets and some more stem packs. Now I do not know if you can see this, but this wall is brown compared to this grey wall over here. Interact with this wall for a chainsaw. So that is secret number six. Let's flip the switch. Let's go back down. Grab the... No, that's suicide. Grab the chain gun. Go down and go crazy. Go insane. And uh, should be fine. Now, both of these alcoves have lost souls, and of course you will attack me. Who wouldn't attack me? There we go. And another lost soul right there. There we go. There's a, um, a shotgunner that sees us there, or a zombie man, doesn't matter. Hug this wall over here, go around this corner, and go inside. Just go insane. Just go insane. And you might be wondering where we are right now. Well, I will show you. After I've cleared a few enemies. And of course, a shotgun right there. So let's look at each and every corner of this room. And uh, this wall is going to lower for us just now. I'll show you just now how to do that. We are back at the circle area, where I told you not to take this this path over here. Where I told you not to take the path, but we're going to sneak attack them from behind. Turn immediately right for this imp. And some bullets, some health, and look, there's a switch right over there. Let's flip the switch. This wall is going to open, like I said, for your next secret over here. Very well done. We are going to uh, assassinate all of the enemies over here. There we go, nicely done, nicely done. Pat on the shoulder. And you must die. Thank you. There's another enemy. If I can just get him. Let him come to us instead. Because that's a pretty ever clever, clever stretch that we're having. Oh, I killed you. Where are you? I don't want to grab the red suit just yet. Where are you? Come, here's my feet. Here's my feet. Scratch my feet. Okay, well, come to you just now. Next area, after we defeated the two zombie men and the um, imp. Here's a nice rocket launcher for you over here. And then, quite a quote, we should have another imp over there. Where are you, impy? I heard you. Ah, uh, let's get you from the opposite direction. So let's grab some bullets. Let's lower this. And... Yes, there's other enemies that hurt us. And there's another secret, a berserk pack. To avoid injuries, <coughs> oh, and by the way, just for texture-wise, there is a brown wall right over there for another secret. Again, we're going to take another jump towards the other enemies as well. So let us, ooh, let us proceed by grabbing some of these items. 
and then the Z truck. Interacting with this wall for the lost soul. Come on. And then this wall over here. And we have a jump on the enemies on top of us. Without any worries. Jumping down. There we go. There we go. Nicely done, Pat on the shoulder. Now, for the fun, fun, fun part. We're going to flip this switch. This island over here is going to lower, revealing two lost souls and a gecko demon. The other enemies that you heard is behind these walls over here, which is a spectre and um, shotgunners. And then that door over there is going to open for us. So what we're going to do is the following. Flip the switch, run out, just run out, and just blow everybody down. Blow them down. Okay, that plan failed. The plan literally failed. You missed, Mr. Shotgunner. That's okay. Here's the red key that we said that we don't really need, but okay. And die. And die. And die. And die. So we still have a caco demon somewhere exploring the room. Which one of There's the caco demon. Go. Nicely, nicely done. Pat on the shoulder. I wish not to die again. Yes, I died before, and this is attempt number two. Okay. So, honestly, we are done, so. We are completely, completely, completely done, so in this room. We have nine secrets. That is exactly what we need. So, let us take this lift out to the blue carpet area right over here nope not right over there let me just check quickly do I have any more bullets or did I waste all of them no over here is next let's grab the chain gun let's grab the chainsaw and quickly quickly deal with these guys where are you? That can't be all of you. How dare you? There's supposed to be a spectre. Where's the spectre? Spectre! I hear you. I forgot about these items. Spectre! Hello? Why were you exploring over here, sir? That's bad manners. Anyway. So, why we didn't take the red door? over here is because we have been here before with all the enemies that we have dealt with including up the stairs including in here which we cannot get through and there's the teleporter right there which one of what I haven't practiced that far yet anyways we have the yellow key and the red key but we need the blue key to go to that blue door next so we have to take the yellow door first. And instead of making, letting me making a noise, there is a lot of enemies over here. And die. Followed by that guy over there. Ow. And there's a pimp right over there. And then the snipers up there. Okay, cool. Nicely done. Perfectly done. Now we have an imp over here. And then grab your chain gun out. Actually, let's grab our shotgun out first. Because the first one, you cannot see him because of the lights. And this is a clever way to actually say, screw this nonsense. There we go. Where are you? So, luckily for my arrow, I can actually see what I'm doing, but rather, it is somewhat difficult for me to see. There we go, and there should be a zombie man over there. And let's 
tug on the left over here for stem packs and armor if you need it. Hug the same techno wall again. And then come on. There we go. Now, I died here the last time because I was stupid because of my rocket launcher. But this time that's why I needed the plasma gun for this fight. Specifically this fight. Interact with the switch and go inside. Just go inside. It is dark, I know. And some of the enemies over there cannot, you know. I can see a little bit of the of the spectre, so we are Gucci. We are Gucci. Okay, I can hear more growls. So let's walk very, very carefully to this side. And there is there we go. The plasma gun actually did me a good job. I'm very happy. There's a shotgun over there. And just die. 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 Now, there is no way to get that up there, sadly. But, let's continue our merry way. And, we have more enemies in each of these alcoves. Where are you? So, next enemy. Keep around the corner. And then there. Thank you. And then there. There we go. Pat on the shoulder. Nicely done. I'm sneaky. Very, very, very sneaky. So we got the blue key. Let's hop down and go to the blue door next. Grab your chain gun next for things like this. And then we have some more lovely items to collect. Especially here. Ow! How dare you, sir? How you can dare you? Let's quickly deal with all of these guys. And then we have a loss to be sold over there. Can you just die, please? Thank you. Appreciate you. Now, out of all these alcoves that we have over here, on the third one is your last and final secret, which is a supercharge. Flip the switch to open the door in the middle of the island and the exit door as well. So, there we go, nicely done. We have a Kakodini. We have a Kakodini right over there. We can tell the Kakodini to stay right there. Like a good sweetness. And die. And die. Die. Okay. Again, I said die. Thank you. And then over there. And then we flip the switch to reveal a bridge for us. So, now that we made the bridge, we have an imp and a lost soul, but they do not count towards the kill count. That's okay. Open up the exit door for two more enemies, and three more bonuses, and that should be it. That is all kills, all secrets, all items. <clears throat> command center. Well, it was a big command center indeed. The the way that this map has been designed is extremely, extremely amazing. Really, truly, really, it is amazing what this map has been doing and how these map makers have made it. Really, truly. Really. Secret placements has been chef's kiss. Really, truly, really, a chef's kiss. And you can't have any better than that. Really, truly, really, you can't have any better than that. There are some mean traps. There are some um, mean monsters like the barons. We hardly see the barons anyways, which that is basically good and bad at the same time. I don't know, but I had fun. I really truly had fun with this map. And if you had fun with me on this map as well, 
hit that thumbs up for me over there. Show YouTube you loved it. If you didn't enjoy it, you know exactly what to do. Subscribe to the channel for more support and hit that notification bell for when more of these walkthroughs, buying dates, plays, other game shenanigans, whatever comes in your way, guys and girls. Thank you once again for watching. Stay frosty, stay safe, stay strong, stay healthy, and remember one thing. There is a flame that burns inside of you, so ignite it and flame on. Cheers, guys. Adios, chilios.